Begin by launching Terminal and logging into your DNS server. If you do not log in as super user, use the sudo command as shown here. You will be prompted for your super user password. Type the password and you will be on the root prompt. Next, check your bind version. Use the command shown here to check and note that this version is higher than 4.0 and we will thus use a standard bind. Now, locate your DNS zone file by using the command shown here. This file by default is located under forward slash etc forward slash nsd forward slash. However, the file may be hidden for security reasons. Please consult with your network administrator if you do not find the file in its default folder. Having located your zone file, you may now edit its contents using a line text editor tool such as Nano or VI. We will use Nano by entering the command shown here. Scroll to the bottom of your zone file and hit enter to create a new line for your record entry. Provide the entry shown here. Note there are seven spaces between each of the first three character sets. Also note, to add a different certification authority as the authorized CA, add the entry related to that certification authority. Press Ctrl X to save the modification, answer yes, and then hit enter to overwrite the changes to your zone file. Restart your DNS service by entering the command shown here. Note, if you receive any errors during the DNS service restart process, go back to your zone file and make sure you don't have any typos. To confirm that your DNS service has restarted successfully, use the command shown here. To check if the CAA record has been updated correctly, use the command shown here.